Hello and welcome back to LT Plays Fallout. This is actually part seven. Uh, last time was part six, and I called it part five the entire time. So I'm not really completely sure why I did that, but I did. So uh, I am now on part seven. Well, I do know why I did that. Um, rank? Because I lost track of how many that I have done. That said, this is the Corvega plant. Um, uh, and it is really intense. <laughs> actually, I, as hard as it is and as much as I've died, I'm actually really enjoying the fact that it's this difficult. Because, it, so I do have a level up, so I should probably use that. Um... If I increase my charisma, I need to increase it too to get the ability to do that. Scrounger's really good. Medic is really important. Um, awareness really is not worth it much. Armor is really important. Um, you gain plus 10 damage resistance. That's not bad at all. So, but next, I'm actually going to be going for the Lone Wander perk. So that's going to require me to have an additional charisma. Um, and I need three to get Lone Wander. Animal Friend can also be pretty good, because you can get a Deathclaw to be your friend. Wasteland Whisper, I think is the, the actual one intimidation. Um... Solar powered. Between the hours of 6 a.m. and 6 p.m. 12 hours of sunlight. Okay, so. Oh, and then I want to check out my uh, new weapon. The submachine gun. So it does, it uses 45 bullets, though. I don't really have any 45 bullets. It's really unfortunate, because I want to use that gun really bad. But I don't have the ammo for it, so it makes it very difficult. I feel like I had killed things because I was down there shooting up here. So, like, I'm looking for all the bodies that I previously left behind. And I just, yeah, it just came from here and I didn't see any bodies at all. So, so we're scaffolding. I mean, it's a lot easier to orient up here, orientate myself, than down there. I know there's. At least a couple people left because my hidden meter is going nuts. <laughs> Hi, dog me. Uh, nice to, you know, you come here often? <laughs> so I just came out through there. Uh, there is an entrance into the Corvega assembly plant. to shoot at me, because that means I haven't been to wherever they're shooting at me. Oh, definitely have not been up here. And it's caution, so that means... Take a... <laughs> Alright, that was easy. I think that might have been the last person. And I think it's been too long, so the bodies that I killed up here must have just been gone. Because I eviscerated a lot of them. I don't know why I was, like, glitch walking up and down there. Um, are you going to let me loot the body? Oh. Ooh, bobblehead. Bingo. Nice. Fusion core is permanently last 10% longer. I'll take that any day. What just... What? <laughs> I'm not sure what just happened to dog me, but something tells me he just fell off the edge. Okay, so I just came from there, so I'm gonna go this way. Do 
not have much ability to run. Entirely my own bad. <laughs> yeah, I really don't think there are any enemies left. So now that I've secured the outside, I'm going to go back in through the front door. Uh, I'm going to eat some food. I get the least amount of rads possible. <laughs> Cram. That's not bad. All right. There's some pipes over here that have not been explored by me yet. I don't know how much fallout, how much fallout, dude, how much fall damage you take in this game. Um, so I kind of want to jump down, but I don't want to just die. So I'm gonna quick save. For I do just in case. This looks like it would be the easiest way down. They do not. That's kind of disappointing. It would be kind of cool if there was a way that I could have just dropped into the plane. So now I'm pretty much all the way full circle back around to where I was uh, earlier, which means you come down here. Hey. Main doors. Whoa. I mean, I guess I didn't loot that before. All right, so let's quick save and let's keep on going. I should probably hotkey, uh, hotkey, hotkey, quick save, so that it's a little easier for me to access it. This should be cleared out. This is the bottom level of the Corvega. Gotcha. It is not cleared out. Or not. <laughs> or not. <laughs> Raiders correct me. This actually, I feel like, would have been a much easier way to come through here <laughs> than, than the way I came through here originally. Uh, which was upstairs. Colander. Why is there a colander in a filing cap? Like, I don't know. What was going on here? I don't want just the bottle. Oh, we'll take that. Scrounger perk helped me out. This would have been so much easier had I gotten this. Nice. Okay, I'm actually gonna start by going underground this time. This is so. This is my. What is with my frames per second? I know there's someone over here because last time I opened these doors, 
There's a guy just sitting here waiting on the other side. There he is. There's that. Alright, well, glad that took care of itself. Oh, alright, glad you took care of yourself. Whoa! Looks like they got a problem with feral ghouls down here, too. Shot glass, bottle cap. Explosive barrel, so I don't want to screw with that too much, but I do want to see if I can. Body. This is where I came in. Fertilizer. That might be handy sometime. Thinking bombs, but also might be handy for settlements. <laughs> we definitely want that. Okay, so this is the stuff I've already been. Was this just a dead end? Like I'm not upset about that, but I am curious. Yeah, it looks like this was just a I save a lot. Makes me feel better. I dog me nice and slow. Lots of oil on the ground through here, so I really got to be careful. play is very nice. I mean, it should be. They're raiders, I guess, but... Feels like there's a spotlight on me. Move, dog meat. Much less confusing going this way, actually. Okay, so this is the room I already cleared. Unless it's been repopulated. No, this is not a room I've already cleared. I have no idea where I am. <laughs> um. Yeah, I do. So this leads back up to the other entrance. Um, right here where you come into the Corvega. Uh, if you go up that way. And then that leads out to the Commonwealth up here as well. Yeah, so... I'm gonna just keep sticking to this side of the Corvega assembly plant. Right? Yeah, so I'm gonna go this way. Connecting. 
I said I was gonna go underground this time. Means this way. Oh, man, so many different ways to go. And an elevator to boot. Going down. Lower level. Um, all right, yeah, this will work fine. Going up. Oh, this is going. I thought it said it was going down to the lower level. Main assembly line. What is going on with my dog? where I just was, so I went up. So is there anything? No, I'd probably just call the elevator now. Okay. Okay, so this is where I feel like the boss is. Uh, so I'm gonna try and see what I can do here. Reef. Reef. So it doesn't have a B, R, I, E, or F. They all have E's. <laughs> what? Where is one that doesn't have an E? They all have E. Steel? Breed? Rate? Ideal? Named? I don't know. Likeness, too. Nice. Protection control. Uh, activate unit. Choose personality mode. Fire brigadier, medical responder, construction worker. Uh, yeah, we'll do default. Activate units. Near charge pouch to make way. Powering up. Protectron on duty. This should take long. Do not make Jerry. further escape again. Bomb breaker. It does not lead anywhere useful. What the heck? <laughs> Evidently I burned myself there. Uh, I'm really not getting used to this throw mechanic. Alright, good news is, I saved just before doing this. I wish there was a way I could make the Protectron... Uh, on my side. I'm through. Law enforcement. I don't know what that's gonna change, but, uh... Powering up. Protectron on duty. Approach and identify yourself. Law abiding citizen will not be harmed. I need to figure out how to get up there. Yep, that's what I need to do. 
your attempted escape is only making things Why does the protect Protectron is killing me in the end. It may start out trying to help, but it doesn't stay that way. <laughs> with the frame rate in this area. It starts with an F. <laughs> uh, no, the second letter is an A. Protectron do as much of this as possible. Oh, now it's on. And I'm gonna come try and mop up later. Protectron starts on my side. Why does he turn hostile? Looks like he's not. Looks like he killed everyone. Protect and serve. Okay. Then I don't know why he kept burning hostile. Commencing. <laughs> of deadly force. Okay, so he tries to kill me as soon as that turret starts to kill me. Alright, now it makes sense. Now it makes sense. So, let's see if I can turn the Protectron off now. Commencing attack on hostile target. Okay. My dog is screwed because he decided to run out there. Shut down unit. And shut down signal received. Unit returning to charge pod. Shutting down unit off. see the turret up there. I still have no idea how to get to this plate. Like, how to get up there. Oh, shit. So that's all taken care of. So that's good. But again, it does not answer the, the time-long question of how the heck a Roonies does one go about getting up there? And I don't know if there is a way up there, which is weird. There's gotta be, right? There's always one guy on the ground floor. Okay, so there's a gate that gets extended across. Think maybe there's a terminal I could hack or something to let me get up. This is the Corvega assembly plan. They produced fusion powered cars. Uh, no, that's not a ladder. I thought that was a ladder for a second. It is now. Okay, come on. What is happening? It doesn't look like it'd be that much a jump, but uh, it seems like it is just enough of a jump that it's not letting my guy do it. Yeah. 
I don't know how to get up there. Which is really unfortunate. Because it looks like it'd be a fantastic climb. Oh, here we go. Alright, lovely animation. Okay. Fusion cells, medics. Alright, now we're starting to get these 10 millimeter rounds to a rocket ship. Good jobs, safe jobs. Protect workers now. Then in the Nuka Cola. Oh! Two Nuka Colas. Never mind. Spoke too soon. What is shooting at me? Vega safe key, 38 rounds, stim pack. Why that? Alright, well that made things simpler. Crazy lady got me. Yes. Of barbarian. Kurtigos, I don't remain tech. Permanently do 5% more damage. Take that. I don't know who's shooting at me. Full disclosure. I hope he comes up here because I don't know where he's at. Alright, Jared's terminal. Let's see if there's anything we can learn from this. Setting up shot. Gunfire is finally quieted down. Suppose that means they had their Lonnie and Crystal wiped up last of the ghouls. They're currently serving as someone's meal. Now Lexington is secure. I can finally get to work. Nothing is working. The old woman, she used to just huff some jet, pop some pills, then she'd start babbling. And I asked her vision, and they all turned out true. The raider is burning the town, killing the parents, stealing the kids, stealing me. I remember the look in her eyes when she saw my fate. Kid, you're going to be a monster. All true. If I could get that sort of power, that sight, the commonwealth, the other gangs, no one would have a prayer. Nothing's working. Maybe I need to try upping the dosages. I'm going to need another bucket. Oh, so they were trying to become Mama Jama. I can't remember her name, but I think it's Mama Jama. It's not the chems. They're just a trigger for the sight. It's me. I'm the problem. Wish I'd realized it before my arms look like pin cushions, but at least it's a new lead. I need subjects. Experiments. Uh, complete. Still no success, but the rumor of free chems has brought up plenty of new recruits. Ranks are nearly back up to where they were before we cleaned out Lexington. Lonnie thinks it's a waste of time, as we need to spend our time building up our defenses. Lonnie doesn't make the decisions. I do. She does seem to be enjoying her new position, though. Maybe another dose of Psycho will get her visions firing. Experiments continue. She's here. Here's the scissors caravan headed this way. Some joker and cowboy hat with a laser musket. Three civilians and one frail old woman dressed like a fortune teller. It's her. I know it's her. Send Gressel to collect her. I wonder if she'll recognize me. Of course she will. She saw this coming after. Spotlight control. So I can turn. System diagnostics. No intruder detected. Ten point. Alright. Deactivate lights. Turret control. Power your defense system. Her average should be limited to trained professionals only. Limited to activation of the action. It's hard line to this terminal for all. Licensed technician. Void warranty in it. Amnify the manufacturer against potential injury in our death. No Robco system diagnostics. Um, 0% offline. Alright, so that's everything I need to know. <laughs>
I got what I wanted. And that's what matters to me, huh? Those are an accident waiting to happen. Alright, so I have officially killed off Jared DeVito. That's not Jared. But Jared. And he is not here anymore. Keep out. That man was still doing his janitorial service when the bombs dropped. I hope he lived a happy life. I hope he lived a life he could be proud of. Okay, okay. I don't think there's anything in here, though. Um, alright, so next up, I can just exit to the Commonwealth and be done with it. Or, this is what I'm actually gonna do. I can go back and I can explore the other side. So far from this plane, I've gotten a uh, Gronag the Barbarian and a Bottlehead. So, alternatively, so I came from here. Uh, going through here. Already went that way. Could go that way, could go down. I'm gonna go down this time. Okay, so I think down leads to where I just was? No, this was the dead end. Alright, I remember. <laughs> Let's go up this time. I'm gonna quick save now that I have completed it. And then I'm gonna turn on my Pip-Boy light. Yeah, you can do that. You hold B. Uh, you hold the Pip-Boy activation button. Whatever it happens to be for you. Uh, right back to the main entrance. So I feel like there are parts we haven't explored yet, but at the same time, I feel like I've explored it all. Uh, either way, I am going to exit back out into the Commonwealth. Daddio raises intelligence and perception, but lowers charisma for a limited period. Popular with beatniks and intellectuals before the Great War. Daddio was popular with the intellectuals. I just imagine a bunch of intellectual people being like, Yeah, let's go take some Daddio. <laughs> yeah, no way, man. Let's all go do some daddy-o. It just sounds so, I don't know, not intellectual. I don't know. All right, now there were some explosions back here, so I would kind of like to explore that. Let's look at our map. We were at the Corvega Assembly Plant, Lexington. I need to go back to Tempine's Buff. Uh, I'm gonna quick save. And then I'm just going to run over towards the the explosions area. See if there isn't anything I can find. Um, not seeing anything in here, but more rubble. Lots of ghouls in here last time I came through here. I have not been up on the scaffolding, or maybe I have been. I killed these people, though. What the fuck was that? They sound like they're right here, but I don't see anyone. What? Get some motherfucker! Where the heck? Oh, they're up there. Yeah, I'm gonna go up through this gap. What is it? it is like glitching out something heavy right now?
dropping at like 15 frames per sec. 10? 15? What is going on? Fat man? Alright. Raider, power, torso. Do right leg, helmet, left leg. Raider, left arm. Where do I keep my... It's not under junk. Miscellaneous? A apparel. It's just a raider left arm. Sounds a little ridiculous. We're just wearing his left arm. We strip the power armor down. Got my medics and everything. So, chemistry station. Longer than the other one. Give them that. This person just pre war just had their chemistry station. Um, oh, I can make buff jet, <laughs> buff jet, and buff tats. Jet. Fireworks. Oh, shoot. Weather change shell. Uh, grenades. I have enough to make Molotov clock. Clock tails. I can make right away. Cool. Need more purified water. A robot repair kit don't need right now. Blood pack. So I had enough to make one. Screw it up. Okay, mines. Bottle cap mine. I can make. But it requires a rank and demolition expert, which I do not have. Traps. That was interesting. I didn't realize there was so much stuff involved in the crafting process. Uh, I am going to take some more. Grilled rad roach. Seems like it'd be helpful. Lexington's kind of been overrun by ghouls here, and the raiders here are actually getting rid of the ghouls, which is awfully useful of them in the grand scheme of things. This just keeps going down and down and down, then it empties out on the street. Another behind it, very plain textures. Okay. Takes so long to look around. Raiders probably took all the high ground. Makes sense. So that's where I was. What has detected me? Dude, 
I only have to hit him once. Why is this becoming such a problem? That was the most powerful shot I've ever had <laughs> with a 10 millimeter pistol. Holy macaroons! Prime rate's down to 16.45. So, um, so I'm actually going to, while I'm in an area where the frame rate is bad, I'm actually going to end this video. See if I can't figure out what is going on. Thank you guys for joining me for part seven of LT Plays Fallout 4. Uh, hope to see you next time. If you enjoyed the video, feel free to leave a like. It helps out a great share. I will see you next time.